I've got with me 18 year old Alicia Wade who has done fantastic in the results. Alicia, what did you get? I got five A stars, so I'm just really, really happy about that. That's brilliant. What subjects did you get the grades in? Um, I got them in geography, biology, chemistry, I'm forgetting, uh, extended project and general studies. That's fantastic. And uh, what university are you going to be going to and what um, are you going to be studying? Well, I'm going now to Manchester to study dentistry. So, yeah. Were these the grades that you were expecting, Alicia? Not at all. I thought I'd get, like, I thought I'd just scrape A's, like, just by one or two UMS. But it's just, like, it's just unbelievable because I didn't even expect this, like, at all. <laughs> and what was it like this morning for you when you checked the UCAS website? Well, I was a bit tired because I've been up all night, <laughs> worried. But then when I checked it, it was, like, a relief that I'd actually got into my uni. Then coming here, like, it's just overwhelming because I thought I'd got, like, A's because I only needed A's to get in, but... A stars is just a, an added bonus, so I'm still just in shock, really. <laughs> How did you do, Adam? Uh, I did okay, but not as good as I was hoping for, really. I got ABC, and I was predicted ABB. And what subjects did you get those grades in? I got an A in uh, uh, geography, uh, an A in general studies, a B in maths, and a C in physics. And is that enough to get you into the u chosen university? I'm not sure yet. Tracks um, not let me in to check my grades yet. Um, I have my choices for university, um, so I'm just keeping fingers crossed, really. But that's still a very good grade. Are, you, are your parents quite proud of you? Uh, I haven't spoken to anybody <laughs> yet about it, but I'm just not sure whether a university's right for me now, um, especially for the course that I've took. Because I worked really hard for the grades, um, spe you know, for especially like physics and maths, and I've only got a B and a C for those. So I'm, I'm kind of looking at doing pilot training or something like that, maybe, yeah. as opposed to university. I mean, there is a lot of pressure this year because the fees are going to be going yeah, up. Course, I mean, yeah. did you feel the pressure this year when doing your exams? Oh, I mean, I, you're going to feel the pressure every year, but, I mean, it does have the pressure quite a lot, really. Um, but I think it's important just to know that there's like plenty of plenty more opportunities, even if you don't get into the first choices at universities. You know, even if it's not university, there's always plenty of different choices. And getting a lower grade if you've worked hard might just mean that you're not cut out for the course at university. Yeah. It's not going to get easier, you know. And I think I understand that no. really. Uh, I got three B's and a C. And what grade? Uh, what subjects did you get them in? I got uh, biology, chemistry, physics, and general studies. Brilliant. And is that enough to get you into the university that you've chosen? It is, yeah. I applied to go to Kiel to do biochemistry and forensic science, uh, and I've actually had that confirmed now. They've sent me a text to say I've had my confirmed place, so I'm very happy about that. That's brilliant. Now, what Adam was saying about the pressure, did you feel the pressure this year when sitting your exams? Yeah, well, I mean, to be honest, you don't, you don't think about it at the time, but it is a very important thing, you know. Obviously, everybody says to you it's best to go this year, and you do make sure you don't have to come back and reset next year or apply next year. So it is, it is a bit, very significant thing. It's obviously a lot of pressure, but just try to get on with it. I know Adam, he, he worked very hard. I know he did, and, you know, it's, you just try to get on with it. Don't you? What do you think about the tuition fees hike to 9,000? I mean, do you think it's justified? Just, just, just got to try to make it so not everybody wants to go to university. I mean, I know it's a good thing going to university, but it's not for everybody, is it? Just, I suppose it's more of a trying to make it look like there are other options, you know, trying to discourage some people from going rather than going just to do any old course, you know. And, but, I mean, look, I'm, I'm not thinking about that, to be honest. I'm more happy about I've got in and I'm happy.